Hello everyone, welcome guys, welcome back for another day with you guys here in good old Call of Duty Warzone. Uh, and I'm the historian, if you guys are tuning in for the first time, historian82. And I'm going to be playing a little bit of that good old Warzone. And we're going to go ahead and jump right into it guys. Go ahead and get into some random quads today. And just some random quads here. One of my operators I liked using in the past. I haven't used her in a while. Uh, we're going to use good old Domino here. Since we are fixed featuring um, France in our Echo of the Past section, I'll we'll talk about in just a second here while we'll I queue up. I had some trouble yesterday with um, the queue. It was kept on just resetting itself. So. Hopefully the queue does good. I was playing some games off stream and it worked just fine last night. So hopefully it was just something related to the update. But that said, guys, welcome. Um, uh, I wanted to talk a little bit about our um, Echoes of the Past section here. Um, this morning I had a little excerpt from a book that's now been turned into a movie called The The Last Duel. And in The Last Duel, it's a story of a knight and squire in the 1300s to end up fighting a duel ordered by the king of France in the 1300s, but they were ordered to fight a duel to the death. And the duel between the knight and the squire, and the knight's name being um, John de Corot, and the squire being uh, Jacques Legree, they ended up uh, fighting a duel to the death because of a dispute. Um, the knight, uh, Jean de Corot, accused the squire, Jacques Legree, of coming into his home while he was away in Paris and violating his wife. And of course, the squire, Jacques Legree, denied that accusation up and down. And long story short, guys, um, it wasn't really decided then, and it's not really clear completely now whether that was true or not. But nonetheless, the court decided to go ahead and have them fight a duel to the death on uh, using lance and, and horse, swords, axes, and also uh, daggers uh, decide the outcome and that little excerpt was a little uh, well the conclusion the dramatic ending of that duel and I will talk about that more a little bit later here just warm up Going on, guys. <coughs> Man, there's two good scabs over here. With, there's got to be a buy post to that, right? Ah, right, that works. Head circle. Yeah. Yeah, that works. Let go there. And if people are dropping with us, we can kick a bounty. Yeah, uh, sounds good. Let's see if we get any stragglers. Uh, here we go. Uh, looks like we got some team that went to Storage Town, but we're looking clear actually where we are. How do we look besides, uh... <clears throat> Besides gold, kept going. 
They're looking good. Doesn't look like a team went where we were. They went to Storage Town. Wait. Oh, it's on the roof or something? Oh, there we go. Here you go, munitions box, right here. Oh my god, shut up the sky Damn, I gotta find a gun. Not sure what happened, yeah, huh, boy? Shit for guns. We need something. I don't care what it is, I just need something. Uh, DMR just dropped out the box here. That Mati pistol. I tell y'all what. There's legitly no guns in here. Hey, maybe we should uh, just push over to the fire station, get at that scav. Oh, blue's already on top of it, yeah. It. Yeah, blue's already there. Alright, I'm gonna push on that. Careful, because there was a team of four that dropped over here by the... Uh... Yep, I'm gonna go around the left side and go up the ladder. Okay. Where? Oh, here we go, guys. A stoner. Oh, yeah, careful, purple. They went through here. There's open boxes. Bounty? Yeah, let's pick that bounty up. Oh, there we go. It's on the Maybe open. Go buy. There's a decent AK. Oh yeah. Dane's all the way back at train station. Should take the vehicle. Look. Wait, what? No, no, there's another buy somewhere. It'll pop up. It'll pop up. I'll find a place. Roger, vehicle. Just marking where the, uh... Bounty was? No, there's gotta be another buy. Somewhere, bro. Can't be. There can't be one buy station for Storage Town Superstore Factory. I think Sounds that. like a pretty great place to be. Hey, Blue. We can pull back to Boneyard. I don't like doing that. Yeah, that one's on the open. That's too fast. Hold on for these guys. They gotta be close. Vendor marked. Oh, yeah. They're closing then. You only got eight seconds left or five seconds left. Shoot the oh, truck, shoot, 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 yeah, we got you, we got you. Got you. Slide me out of the truck while it was moving. Sketchy. Somebody right here, full team. Movement! Movement! Time to play. Time to play. Never mind. Setting away. Enemy UAV overhead. Play it in here if anybody needs it. Here, I'll take it. Another one upstairs if you want it. Yeah, I'll take them all. A little bit low. Da, 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 da. Yeah. Alright, cool. Hey Blue, I think you're right. I think I'm there's gonna... I think there's more play or I think there's I'm more gonna... buy stations. I'm gonna stay on the, the roof here and watch what's coming in. Okay. You got guys okay, over so here? Blue, I'm. 
Lou, I think you're right because I heard rumor that there was um, some glitches lately where the buy stations aren't showing up on the map. So I think you're right. There has to be more. There's not one here. Yeah, I'm just going with blue. Blue on right behind you, bud. I saw him. He's too far. This is insane. I'm catching up to you guys. Not, not one here either. <laughs> well, maybe there isn't a glitch. <laughs> I decided to be uh, skimpy on the buy stations. Oh. And one just popped up at Superstore now. Yeah, I just saw somebody, somebody uh, just get there. a loadout over there. Yeah. yeah. Well, where's that coming Somebody's from? shooting me from hotel. So I'm popping his head up up here. I copy. That's it. And towards the airport. Should have grabbed that scab in stores while we were here. Hopefully it went to airport. I'm gonna kick off this recon. Or do you guys want to skip it? Actually, never mind. I'm gonna uh, catch up to you guys. Our main thing should be looking for. Just yeah, yeah, yeah. To this. Sniper rifle here. Oh yeah. Save it for me. Gotta go across the airfield though. We can go underground or we can go around. Never mind. Either way, we gotta go. In on care package. That's how we I'm go. Blue around the side. Okay. Take zip. I'll Got let you know. Roof looks good. All right, right behind you. SMG marked. Somebody on our loadout. Got to move around on the left side. Where are they? They're on our loadout. Are they still there? Yep. I don't see them. They're there. Done one? Oh yeah, they're there. Yep. Wait, cancel that. Over there. So, we got guys in the tower? Oh shoot. Still on our loadout? Got him. Got him. I'm oh down. shoot. Hey, Blue, come pick me up. I gotta take the zip back. Oh, careful, careful. There's someone shooting for you from shot. inside the airport. Oh shoot, they're <laughs> shooting from the tower. The radio tower. Yeah, I'm getting shot from the top. Somebody's on the airport. Somebody's on the roof. Okay. I'm down. They don't we think we could get. Oh shit! Sniper? Yeah, I still don't see anyone on top of the airport. Sniper's on the top. He's there for sure. Okay. At the front edge. No, he's he's there. He just shot at me. Took two plates. Hmm. Okay. Oh. Nah, right, I'm back. Enemy UAV overhead. Oh yeah, Are got someone. On the roof or, or downstairs? I'm down. I'm ground I'm down level. All the way through the. 
I hear a red door. Or it is. Yeah. Somewhere right here. Repositioning. Just took out a guy inside the airport. I don't know if it was the guy from earlier. But he's down. Found the red door. Right here, purple marker. Ground level. We should take it. Everybody, if everybody has their loadies anyway. Uh, I don't have it, but I want to. I'll take it anyway with you guys. That loadout's way too. Uh, uh, I gotta come back to you guys. Which which color pen? Uh, purple. Purple. All right. I'm gonna see if I can snag my loadout first, real quick. You might as well. I don't see dude in the tower. He must have jumped to get his loadie. Yeah, I'll do it too then. Silent so got mines. Get up come there, back. Domino. Headed to the purple pen. Right, we're still there. I'm mounted. Yeah. Wait for him to take us. Gas is coming. Are we gonna do the door? Yeah, take it, take it, take yeah, it. We all here? No. Nope. I'm coming, come, come, come. Oh. Take it, take it, guys, take it. All right. We're going through. Uh, right. which right. door? Which yeah, one this one right here. I this, one. this one. Yep. No lightning. Yep. Good. Hope it just put us into a free fall. Nope. Yeah. We good. Oh, my God. Hold on, plate up. I got plates for you. Oh, you got him? Wait, where's the other guy? What happened to... Uh, oh, oh. Where's yellow? Oh, no. Yellow's in gas. Oh. In gas. Oh, dang. He didn't make the door? Nah, he didn't make it. Though. We can buy him back. Yeah. yeah, yeah, we can do that. Hold on. Let's see where a buy station is. Yeah, there's yes, one right there and one right there. All right, opening the door. We got a team pushing us. Ooh, ooh, ooh. We got a team pushing us. Yep. Yep, yep, yep. It's coming around. Coming around right now. Oh, my God. Uh -oh. They're waiting. Oh. oh Jesus! Here, can you make it around there to the side? No, there's there's a sniper holding the door, and there's a guy. In front. Yep. Oh, these oh, guys, shit. man. I got man. Oh I shit! Oh, oh no way! No no no! He's cheating for sure. <laughs> they were in right there. I don't know if he's cheating, but I got destroyed. He had aimbot for sure, hundred percent. Yeah, that was. He hit hey Blue, he I got gotcha. you. perfect on one of you, and then one right on me. Both blue, he's center. Shots. Hey, Blue, he's center, center. In the back center, now he's going left. To your left. Left side. Wow. He's high ping, too. Drew Weezy. He's super high ping. I got that around the corner. and you return to the front line. But if you lose, you're done here. Time to earn your freedom, soldier. He's AFK. There you go. Yeah, I think he woke up right at the end there. So, let me get this straight. These dudes killed us. Got about... 30 grand. Where were they at, right? Mm. Here? Yeah. You might as well just drop straight down and play from the edge again. See if you can at least get some money or something. Or you can do this. There's just not a lot of room to roam. If you do this, you should be able to pull out. I'm doing that, that one right there. I'm doing that one, guys. Yeah. Get at least one of. Do at least get at least one of you guys back. Maybe I could get some cash along the way and get to at least some of those buildings that are yep. environment rich. 
Let's see. You have fun. Oh, someone just bought a loadout. I saw that drop in. See that? That radio tower? Alright, get low, get fast. That's not what I want to do. Again, that window. There we go. Damn, man, he's going to have to work. Oh, shit. Dang. Yeah, good run. Hey, let's run that back. Yeah, good game, guys. Do that again. That's fine. How the hell we ended up with 11th when we were just running freaking crazy the whole time? Dang, that was unfortunate. Yeah. I got zero that was unfortunate. We had the had the plan going, except for yellow. The yeah, they caught up with us. They caught up with us. Yes, they did. So. Back to the story, guys. Um, back to the story of Jean de Caro and Jacques Legree. They were ordered by the King of France to fight a duel to the death. And uh, this duel, this judicial duel that they fought, um, was interesting because, of course, we know uh, Jean de Caro's accusation and as well as his wife Marguerite's accusation. But what's interesting is also Jacques Legree's defense. And, of course, right away he denies the allegations up and down, says he was never at the home at all. And he says in this trial testimony that he actually had only met Marguerite two times, once at the wedding and another time at a, a, a celebration of the birth of the Count's uh, latest child. And he says that uh, Jean de Croix asked his wife to kiss him uh, just as a sign of peace. And we say, they say kiss and there is so was a custom back then. Um, they usually kissed each other on the cheeks, but um, yeah, they don't really go into detail how much I noticed that the movie just assumed that men on the lips, but that didn't necessarily mean on the lips back then. But he says that I was actually asked by the knight for his wife to kiss him. And... Um, yeah, he said that's the only two times that he ever, ever met the lady. And, you know, the day of the accusation, of course, he says he wasn't there at all. What was interesting was, was uh, Jacques this was saying that this wasn't the first time that Jean de Caro had the night had accused him of, um, of adultery, you know, with his wife. Uh, he says his first wife, he actually asked her to bear false witness against him. He says his first wife was a good lady and that she actually ended up uh, refusing. And he says that Jean de Caro became very mad at that and basically was really horrible as wife, to his wife right up to the day she passed away. And then when he married a second wife, and in this case Marguerite, it's kind of the same deal. And yeah, it's interesting that he says that there was a, a day where Marguerite was at the home. Her mother-in-law actually left out of town and their head servant, or her, her head servant, left the house. And that's when the event happened. But... What was interesting was, was he said that when Jean de Caro came home from Paris, 
He was really mad at the fact that she, the Marguerite, the wife, had left herself alone and allowed that servant to leave. So according to uh, Legree, uh, Jacques Legree, he says that Jean de Corot ended up beating the servant and actually ended up being his wife uh, because he was so angry. And then he says, because he did that, he made the two ladies very fearful. And that's when he ended up coercing his wife to go ahead and bear false witness against him. So that's interesting. He's basically saying, hey, this guy's had it out for me ever since I started tax collecting for the, the count. He's mad that I tax collected and now he's trying to get revenge against me personally. And that's the reason why he made these false accusations. And that's, uh, that's sad if that really happened because it ended up working uh, and ended up, you know, coming down to this whole, you know, duel to the death. So, yeah, that's, uh, that's something they don't say in the movie, actually. It's an interesting, very interesting tale. I'm wondering if, uh, This thing loaded correctly. We've been sitting here on this uh, loading screen for quite some time here. Uh -huh. Had some trouble with the servers yesterday. I'm wondering if these uh, COD servers are having trouble again. I'm gonna give it about another minute here. Then we'll. Uh, Let's see if it pulls out of this. Nope. I do believe it messed up, guys. Looks like I'm going to have to pull out and run this again. Close that down and launch again. That's too bad, I like that team too. Let's see if the uh, COD servers fix themselves again. Wait for this to load up here. Get back in here. Oh no, maybe something happened to that server. Try that again. Twenty four hour first access. Twenty four hours of exclusive access to Caldera, the new Pacific War Zone map. A digital purchase of Vanguard. 24 hour access. All right. That's too bad. I really like that team. I was looking forward to playing another game with them, but life moves on. We roll with another team. Still working on this battle pass. I think I'll end up completing it, but still working on this thing. Oh, I didn't realize they had a Antonov skin. That's cool. Check this out here. What's Antonov running here? She got Antonov. Oh. Camo, camo going on there. All right. Cool. Alright, 
waiting for our next team to load up here. But yeah, Jacques and John, very dramatic, very dramatic fight there to the end. If you guys haven't seen the movie, despite some inaccuracies inside the movie, I do recommend see it. Um, the Last Duel, if you guys haven't seen it, it's uh, very entertaining and have you see right to the end. I won't, uh, yeah, I won't not give it that, it was very entertaining. And they did stick to the story pretty close, but that's all what always does, they threw in some dramatic flair. Alright guys, let's say hi to the team here. Hey, how's it going guys? Hey, one guy mics. Hey, one on the mic. Alright, go into the airport. Hey guys, if you see any plates, let me know. Running, uh, I haven't picked up any plates yet. Does anyone need this? Does anyone need this? Your teammate was sent to the Gulag. They'll fight for a chance to redeploy. Located a supply box. Secure that position. Contract updated. New objective identified. Oh, we got red door right here, orange. Red door, a purple marker. Your teammate got a proper sorting. We're sending them home. Contract 
Hey Orange, let's go ahead and go outside and grab um, fire guys back. Look here, there's a buy station right there. Going back inside to get that scavenger. Assault rifle here. Oh, some people at storage town. Hey guys, we got enough to go ahead and get a, a loadout. Let's go ahead and meet at that buy station again. Combine money, we could get our loadout. Oh. Alright, meet on that one. Uh, parking garage. Almost got enough to just need a little bit more either green or blue. Found a vendor, get you supplies. Hey blue, I'm right by this uh buy station here. If you drop the cash we could get the load up, but just need uh, eight hundred more. Hey Blue, go ahead and drop 800. Oh no, you... Shoot. Damn Blue. Okay. You need 800 more, I guess. Either from green or... Or find 800 bucks. Going back in the airport now to get the 800. Hey Orange, Orange hold up for a second but I'll give you your money back since we got a loadout that just dropped. We give you 4,000. Hey Orange, let me give you your money back. guys I'll get another loadout thank you orange so if you guys didn't get ghost you could get ghost there you go it's coming out
Hey guys, I don't know about you, but the way the circle's moving, thinking we should go to the hills, either up here at the mines or this office building. Use that vehicle right there. Hey Blue, go ahead and hop in when you're ready, bud. Hey, what's Blue doing? Hey Blue, you gonna hop in? Someone over there, uh, over there at the radio tower, or control tower, and up to the top of the building. Definitely at the top of the control tower, guys, right here. Moving here. Two of them in that control tower. Enemy UAV overhead. Got two over at Storage Town as well. Guys, if you still want to get out, you still got that rover, remember. Copy. Transport. Get out of the way. I am the driver. I think we should move up here. Purple marker. I think I could get there. I'm moving the purple marker, guys. Enemy UAV overhead. Got him. I guess teammate was all just back. Yep. Win here and you return to the front line. You lose, your fight is over. Time to earn your freedom, soldier. Flash out! 
What? Oh, he shoot me, he was flashed. Couldn't see nothing. that uh, scavenger in there if you pick up that scavenger contract you could probably escape up a few little bit of money to buy one of us back Oh guys, I know one thing for sure, these guys don't speak English because I heard the guy hop on the mic for just a second. Not sure what Blue's thinking here, pretty sure they are a new player. A legit new player. Yeah. Yeah. Because you could just tell by his actions he wasn't trying to scare enough money or anything to try and buy anyone back, so, oh well. God lesson learned, I suppose. All right, guys. Well, I want to thank you guys for joining in. That's too bad we lost our first team, but hey, so so the story goes in COD. I want to thank you guys for joining in today. If you uh, hop down to even just join the stream for a little bit, thank you guys for that. I will be back tomorrow with you guys for some more Warzone. Until then, guys, you all make your own history out there today. And I'll see you guys tomorrow. Take care.